I've seen tons and tons of NASCAR fans say that the sport is in a new age or a new era, and it's hard to really argue against this with some of them, with some of the moves that the sport has either made or is going to make. A playoff system has been implemented. A new car is in the wings for the 2022 season. Huge schedule changes have been made and may still be to come. New leadership has represented the sport for years now. The sport has been a leader instead of a follower in bringing live sports back after the pandemic. They supported BLM and Pride Month in the same week, and now they've banned the Confederate flag at races. Whether you like it or not, NASCAR is in a new age right now. But with all of that, we are still stuck in the middle of an old era TV contract with Fox Sports and NBC Sports that runs through the 2024 season. So by 2025, NASCAR needs to have a new broadcasting contract. This is where NASCAR, in my humble opinion, should try to innovate in a way that no other major sports league has done yet. This is to partner up with multiple streaming services and websites for broadcasting. Maybe even do it with NBC or Fox powering it. Many have called for Fox to leave and now have NBC take over or maybe even have ESPN jump back on. On the ESPN front, I don't think most want to see NASCAR partnered with a network that is merely the regurgitated CNN of football and basketball. But on the major end of this thing, TV is going the way of the dinosaur among young people in pop culture, much like how radio did. It's still there, but it isn't the most popular medium. It's a sinking ship that most under the age of 65 either have or will jump off of. Instead, younger people are watching via internet or streaming services. Now, I don't think NASCAR should have its own streaming service for races, though. This would make the sport much more difficult for new fans to find, so I don't think that this would be the best course of action. When it comes to streaming services, NASCAR should partner up with and be broadcasted with large reaching services. Ones like Hulu or Netflix or Amazon and such. It's not what these services do now, but NASCAR could be a great test for something new. These services are used by the masses, so it definitely has a farther reach than Fox or NBC would, and for sure more than FS1 and NBC Sports Network do. If NASCAR, for instance, paid to have themselves put as a number one trend or recommendation on one of these things, then it could pay huge dividends in the future. The same could be done and said if NASCAR partnered with YouTube. A live streamed race on YouTube would be the easiest way for NASCAR to be seen. Anywhere that has internet connection has YouTube for free and a free way to watch the race. It also opens up the live broadcast up to the world. Fans from the UK or Brazil or New Zealand all could watch the race live with people from the United States who watch it live every week. And they could communicate with one another. We have seen tests of this used in both real racing and iRacing. In real racing, in-car views have actually been shown and streamed on YouTube as well as Twitter and Twitch. In the major iRacing leagues, the races nearly always are streamed on iRacing's main YouTube channel or NASCAR's channel. Huge crowds for these events come out and could be a precursor of things to come for NASCAR itself. If NASCAR did any of these options, then they potentially could be 5-10 to 10 years ahead of any other major sports competition. But with that, I want to pass it on to you. What ways do you want to see NASCAR's broadcasting change in the coming years? Let me know down in the comments below. And while you're at it, leave a like and subscribe to my channel for more great NASCAR content. And until next time, have a good one.